In this lesson, we're going to learn how to install Bento 4 on Windows. First, we're going to install Python 3.8 and test the installation. And then we're going to install Bento 4, which involves four steps. First, we'll download the utilities, then we'll drag it into a folder, insert it into our Windows path, and then test installation. When I first started working with Bento 4, version 2.7 was required, and any version that was 3.0 or above did not work. Bento 4 has changed that, and now 2.x is no longer supported, which is why we're installing version 3.8. And I'm going to do that down here. So I'm going to type in Python, and Windows is going to recognize that it's not installed. So I will get it from here and install. First, I'll download. and then the installation will start automatically. And I can check installation by typing Python there, and we see that it's installed. So one down. Next, we want to go to Bento 4. We want to download the binaries for Windows 10. We'll send these into our Downloads folder. Very tiny, show in Finder. And what I want to do is create a Bento 4 folder. So I will and then go back to my downloads and copy Bento 4 into the folder. Then I will extract all. and drag all these folders into the Bento 4 root. So I've got all these loaded here. Now what I have to do is tell Windows where these programs are. So I'm going to come down here and type path. And I'm going to go to environmental variables, path, Edit, New, and I'm going to add C Bento 4 bin to my path. And then I'm going to reboot the computer. Okay, so we're back after the reboot. Let's make sure that Bento 4 is running. So this is a Bento 4 command, and we see that the program is recognized. Just for fun, I set up these batch files with version 2.7 of Python and Bento 4. And let's make sure they still work. So this batch file, let's see what it's doing. It's using MP4 HLS to create an HLS presentation from these three video files in this audio file. So this is an HLS output. And if I double click here, we see it run. And here's the output. So that's working. And then I believe it's batch 11.5. And let's see what this does. This calls MP4 dash, so it's creating dash NHLS output using another MP4 utility. So let's make sure this still works. We double click. And here's all the output. So after installing, Python 3.8 and Bento 4, it's continuing to work with the batch files from learn to produce video with FFmpeg in 30 minutes or less. That's it.